deep within the ancient mythology of India, there exists a concept that weaves together the interconnectedness of the universe and the intricate artistry of spiders. Today, we embark on a captivating exploration of Indra's web. In Indian mythology, Indra was revered as the ruler of the gods, presiding over the heavenly realms. It is within the celestial realm that the concept of Indra's web unfolds. Indra's web is a metaphorical representation found in Buddhist and Hindu texts, symbolizing the interconnected nature of all things. According to these texts, Indra's web is an infinite cosmic web that extends in all directions. At each juncture of the web, there is a radiant and shimmering jewel-like dewdrop representing an individual existence. These dewdrops reflect and refract the light from all the other dewdrops, creating a mesmerizing interplay of color and patterns. The story of Indra's web unfolds within the celestial realms, where the king of gods, Indra, resides. Indra is said to be the weaver of this magnificent web. He is both the creator and the creation, symbolizing the inherent interconnectedness of all things. In this mystical realm, Indra's palace shines with a resplendent beauty, adorned with countless jewels that reflect and refract the light. One day, as Indra sat on his magnificent throne, he contemplated the nature of existence and the intricate connections that bind all beings. Indra's mind began to delve deeper into the nature of reality. And as his thoughts expanded, he envisioned a vast cosmic net stretching in all directions. The celestial net was woven with incredible precision and care, radiating with an ethereal luminance. At each junction of the net, there was a sparkling dewdrop jewel, glistening with its own unique brilliance. Indra realized that each jewel was not only connected to every other jewel, but also reflected the entire web itself. Every thread and every jewel contained the entirety of the universe within it. Intrigued by the profound implications of Indra's web, Indra summoned wise sages and celestial beings to contemplate its significance. Together they explored the intricate patterns and connections marveling at the interplay of light and the complex tapestry of existence. They discovered that the interconnectedness represented by Indra's web extended beyond the celestial realm. It embraced the world of humans, animals, plants, and all aspects of the natural world. Every action, thought, and emotion contributed to the vibrant and delicate balance of the web. This taught the sages and celestial beings that no being or phenomenon existed in isolation. Every existence, no matter how small or seemingly insignificant, played a vital role in the grand symphony of life. The well-being of one depended on the well-being of all, and the actions of one rippled through the entire interconnected web. Ender's web became a timeless metaphor for the nature of reality. It urged individuals to cultivate compassion, wisdom, and an understanding of the profound interconnectedness that underlies all existence. It also emphasized the concept of dependent origination, which states that all phenomena arise and exist in dependence on other phenomena, and that no individual or element exists in isolation. It inspires us to recognize the consequences of our actions and the impact they have on the greater web of life. This interconnectedness suggests that the actions of one being can have far-reaching consequences that ripple through the entire web of existence. This metaphorical tale also points to the illusory nature of reality. Just as a dewdrop in Indra's web reflects the entire web, 
Our individual experiences and perceptions are shaped by the interconnectedness of all things. It encourages us to recognize the interplay between our thoughts, our actions, and the greater fabric of existence, knowing that our choices and actions have the potential to impact the well-being of others. It invites us to transcend the illusion of separateness and embrace a deep sense of interconnectedness, fostering harmony, unity, and a profound reverence for all of life. Now let's journey into the realm of spiders, where their masterful web-weaving skills mirror the essence of Indra's web. Spiders have fascinated humans for centuries with a remarkable ability to weave intricate webs. Their webs serve both as traps to capture prey and as their homes. Each spider species has its distinct web design, reflecting their specific needs and hunting strategies. These all-inspiring structures not only showcase the spider's skill, but they also reflect the interconnectedness within nature itself. As a spider begins its web-building process, it meticulously releases delicate threads of silk, constructing a complex network that extends in multiple directions. These threads interconnect and intersect, forming an elaborate pattern just like the interconnected nature of Indra's web. The sticky strands of a spider's web not only catch prey, but they also act as vibration detectors. When an insect lands or struggles in the web, the spider can sense it and swiftly respond. So in essence, the intricate web these spiders weave serves as a finely tuned instrument, maintaining a delicate balance within their ecosystems. And just as Indra's web represents the interdependence and interrelation of all things, spiders and their webs symbolize the delicate interconnectedness found in the natural world. When we observe the intricate patterns and design of a spider's web, we are reminded of the profound truth that all life forms are interconnected, reliant on one another for the balance and harmony of our planet. So the next time you encounter a spider's web, take a moment to contemplate the intricate beauty of its design. Reflect on the ancient wisdom of Indra's web and the interconnected nature of all things. If you enjoyed the story of Indra's Web, then you will definitely enjoy this drawing by Graco's Creations, featuring the Postletheria regalis, which come from the same area that the story of Indra's Web originated in Buddhist and Hindu philosophies. I'll leave a link down below in the description for Graco's Creations Etsy store, where you can pick up one of these limited edition hand-drawn works of art. As always, I appreciate you watching. Subscribe if you'd like to see more. Thanks for buying Tarantula Collective merchandise, and I will see you next Tuesday.